and we have for you guys quest victim release and balance balance came up now you like a fourth sign it came out interesting and on the bottom we have service service comes up a few signs too so you might be called to help someone emotionally physically take care of something or someone so let's see first card we have is quest so this card talks to me about searching trying to figure out you know what's best what's how to do things better um because you always like crossroads isn't it it's like either could be this way or could be this way so um i think it's all about what you choose to to do and what you know about situation where you can move from now on Another card I have, victim. Interesting. So, some of you might feel that you are a victim of a certain situation. Um, this dragon and squirrel is an, in another card, I think it's saying trick, trickery, something like that. So, maybe you, someone's lied to you about something. Someone could broke their promises or, told you porkies you know how are they saying it's certain situation you might find yourself um that you've been lied to someone trick you to get into into the situation then we have release so it's calling you to release what is not serving you what you scared of it what you don't like anymore you know uh what is not good for you you know, just release the past. If you've been searching for some kind of answers and you find out that it's not going to work, let's say you started a new job um, or about to take a new job and you'll find out that there's no way you can get a, any higher progress in, in any way, financially or professionally, maybe it's time to leave it. In relationship, if you feel that your, for some of you do feel that partner might say, oh, it's all right. I don't want to have kids. You know, if you don't want to, I don't want to. And maybe now to that point, like your partner, no, I want kids, but you just, wait a minute, but you said you don't. We agree to that. And or opposite of situation, you know, they say they want children. They don't want children. Or they say they want to live in a countryside and they don't, when this opportunity now is coming to do so, they don't want to. So everyone is going to be in different kind of situation and you might feel that you've been tricked into the situation and it looks like, like you had to invest yourself and time into this, this certain situation and you were just going to feel, wait a minute, why? You know? For others, it's going to be like worse versus, you know, situation. Don't try to trick anyone believing what you don't, what you want. Tell them the truth, you know. Um, don't try to trick persons stay with you with lies. Don't uh, make other persons stay with you uh, because you actually have different opinions of you or certain situations. Let them know the truth, you know. And if it's your person... It, it will stay with you. If not, it's not meant to be. That's why, you know, if you will start trying to trick someone in, even though there is no cards, as I said, those two appeared in the trickery card, you know, you might find yourself in a tricky situation. And you were just like, what did I do now? You know, because it will come out sooner or later. The, you know, your lies or someone's lies going to come to the light and you just, that person, are you going to question your choices and what kind of choice you should do next? Okay, so for some of you, it all four cards might resonate. For some of you, just maybe one. So let's see what kind of additional info, uh, messages we can get for you guys.
Okay. So let's clarify it for a quest. And we have Nine of Cups in reverse and King of Swords in reverse. Interesting. So, lack of clarity about the future or maybe you start thinking that what you want is actually what you really want. <laughs> I hope that makes sense. Because Nine of Cups is dreams come true. You know, it's being happy in your situation. It's like <sighs> inner security, you know, it's all the good things. But because we have like in reverse, we have quests, I do feel that you will start questioning, some of you might start questioning the the things you're doing are you want to do it anymore because you don't see clarity king of swords in reverse so he's not sure what he's doing he's uh, have no idea what's going on you know if upright position is a person who's like straight uh, knows what he wants you know um Communication is clear, but at the moment nothing is clear. It's like, is it really what I wanted to do? What is really wanted to do in my life? Or maybe you've been so concentrated in your like career, or for some of you so concentrated in a love life that you forgot what's your career goals or your relationship goals. So it could be some kind of awakening happen. You will, your realiza realization was going on. For others, you feel you might be dealing with the earth sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Um, and this one was, uh, reminds me of Libra too. So you might be dealing, or maybe you have this Libra in your moon arising sign. But yeah, that crossroad, that realization now coming from because you just come to realize, oh my God. I always thought, you know, after doing this or that, I'm going to do this and this. Why am I not doing it? Why forget about it? Why forget about, you know, this kind of stuff? For everyone, is going to be different. So it's just that, you know, I could start giving you examples um, over and over and over again. But, you know, it's still not going to be exactly for everyone. So please do apply for your situation. So, victim card. We have page of wands in reverse with two of swords. So, definitely, it was some kind of decision involved, you know. Um, someone wasn't fair to you. So, you have now two court cards in reverse. So, you might feel victim, you know, of someone's lie, you know, someone tricked you. Maybe someone said, oh, it's going to last just a, oh, take this temporary position, you know, for a month, two, three. And it's now two, three years, you're still in it, you know. Uh, maybe your partner said, you know, oh, I just need to travel for my work, you know, just for first half a year or so. And now five years in it, you're still traveling. Uh, for others could be partner just keep, I don't know, parting and stuff on and just like, it's not stopping and you just start, wait a minute, I'm investing myself. I can't wait for ages. I need to start making choice. And you need to cho choose to see you, yourself. Are you going to see yourself as a victim? Or you're going to see yourself as victorious, you know, in winning in situation. Winning situation, it could, sometimes victory is bittersweet, but if you stand up for yourself, it's a victory. So we have another card saying release. So releasing something dark, something is not serving you anymore. So it could be that situation. And we have the chariot in reverse with the eight of cups. So it's movement not happening. Movement not happening in your workplace. It could be as I said, you know, maybe you got stuck in your position and there's no more prosperity of getting any promotion and stuff or working with the, um, bigger clients or something or taking up bigger projects. 
For others, it could be just you can't move forward in your relationship anymore because your partner actually doesn't want to do that anymore. You're finding out that your partner actually don't want to move on anymore. They're happy where they are. They live just living together. They don't want to get married or something. I'm not saying it's for everyone. I said it's for everyone is different situation, but movement is not happening. Again, it could be that you might be dealing with the cancers we have few cups in the reading too and I th it does talk the ending is there if you choose to to end the situation you're not happy with it it's up to you if you will decide to walk away for others for those who decide to trick your partner in it into doing something victimizing your partner and lied about something and now don't want to take a next step or something, your partner will decide to walk away from it. They will have just enough. Okay, balance. Balance, balance, balance. And we have a hangman in reverse. And we have two of cups. Wow. So for those who's been very si single, <laughs> very single, <laughs> single for a very long time, I think it's, it's ending. If you realize that you're worthy and um, you're good enough for that person or you're good enough to have lovely relationship, you know, um, that you, if you would believe that every person is different, if you want to carry the past her to the new relationship, I think um, for some of you, new relationship is on arising. And maybe balance card this comes up because you need to balance things out in your head. You know, you need to make sh sure you're not comparing your partner, new upcoming partner um, or possible partner to previous ones. Uh, for some of you, it could be um, starting new relationship up to just leaving someone else. And, you know, I always said and I will say it, you know, for everyone is different. Sometimes when we separate from someone, we <laughs> can meet someone next day and fell in love. For others, needs a half a year or a year to to stay by themselves there is no right or wrong you know it's for if every situation is different and for some of you do feel as soon you will decide to walk away something great you sometimes some you're gonna meet someone for others it could be just a friend um you know you might find a friend in someone you didn't expect to Okay, let me pull one card from this person of love. And we have for you guys, love is all around you. There is love everywhere, all the time. Simply acknowledge this as a truth. I do feel and hear a message that someone secretly loves you, but you refusing to see it, that person. That person could be around you for many, uh, could be even many years or many months in your circle of friends or work or stuff. And for some of you refusing to see that person because you always saw us a friend. But you might figure out that, uh-huh, it's actually, we have same views. You know, we could be great together. There's some messages coming for for, for some of you. <clears throat> Sorry. So let's see what kind of messages um, we can get for you for this card. And it says, look around you and recognize that love is showing itself to you all the time and everywhere. It might be a smile on a stranger's face or a simple act of kindness. It may be a warm sun in a blue sky. Life is wonderful. How lucky you are to be so loved. So you have people, you know, surrounding you who loves you and if you're struggling in certain situations, in relationship, you need to know that you have people who care for you and will be by your side, you know, on, on every step of the way, whatever you decide to do. But what I do feel is for many signs, uh, more and more messages coming through, they need to start doing something 
say goodbye to things they're not serving you, not making you happy anymore. You know, this year by the looks is just go get it. Go do it. Go reach for the stars. So very happy, you know, those, see, to see those kind of energies. Just you need to, um, learn to see those signs and recognize, um, recognize that no one else, uh, would help you best if you can help yourself. Love yourself first. Yeah. Love yourself. Then you can share love. Okay, thank you very much for watching this video.